God. Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. We have a full restock from the team. One box of bars, one bag of Southern Style coating, one low dough brownie mix, and a ton of bases. Thank you, Luke. Thank you, Lodo. I appreciate you. I'm gonna have one of these and one of these tonight, just for a change, you know. Final days of the deficit, it would have been a shame to have to miss out. What's up guys, Liam here and welcome back to LSJ TV. Drop this video a like if you're excited. Excited, Ex excited. <laughs> Let's get started. I don't say it a lot because I think it's actually fairly obvious at this point. I do work with Lodo. I do have a Lodo code. There is a link in every single video. Go and check it out. I cannot, and I repeat, I, I can't emphasize this enough. I rely on their stuff. I consume one of their products in some shape or form, whether it's one of the cake bars, the Lodo, they're my two kind of faves, but everything, myself and Charlotte have a Friday night fake away with the Southern Fried Coating Chicken thing, you know, saves me having a KFC. This genuinely would not happen without Lodo. I, I honestly cannot express that enough. If you've been watching the channel recently, you will know that I'm nursing a bit of a knee injury, which, which is getting better, by the way. I'll do a full kind of video um, over the next kind of week or so. That's the plan anyway, to kind of update you on that properly. But the past kind of six weeks of the diet, it's been very, very difficult for me. And I know it sounds daft and it's stupid to complain about and like, there's so much going on and like, oh, boo-hoo, Liam, what's, like you're struggling with your diet? Oh, oh, wow. But hear me out, right? Because the past few weeks, obviously with my knee going wrong or tits up or however you want to put it, every single teeny little calorie that's in that deficit that's helped me continue to lose weight has been from taking food away taking two, 300 calories a day away every single day rather than burning an extra two, 300 calories a day. And although that's nothing to really moan about, I'm still having a couple thousand calories. It's not the way that I would have liked to have finished the diet. So 159 is in sight. I mean, it's fine. It's in like two days and this is my kind of competition video, if you like. I think this morning we were 160.2 or 160.3. So like we're gonna hit 159, it's fine. But I'm just saying it's been a bit more difficult and a bit more of a journey than I would have liked, you know? And it would have been a lot more difficult without those Lodo bars, those Lodo bases. You guys know, right? Link's in the description box. I, I'm seriously, bulking or cutting, I'm gonna be eating this stuff every single freaking day, okay? So, just to kind of give you guys a little bit of an update, this is where we are at. We'll do a full-on kind of physique update, but this is like, I've just had dinner, literally just had dinner. Shoulders nice and pumped, forearms coming through nicely now. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. I also have this, which is a Dove Summer Revived Body Lotion. Um, I was advised by my lovely girlfriend, by Charlotte, to actually apply this for my summer shredding entry so that I don't look like a complete pet. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm a pretty pasty guy. I'm not very tanned. So this, <laughs> we're gonna do some experimenting with this. And uh, fresh fade, tan, and that's as good as it's gonna get. <laughs> Fresh trim acquired, tan applied. I don't know whether you can tell. Didn't really have that much impact when I woke up first thing this morning, but it is really like, I mean, it's, what time is it now? It's like 1 p.m. And yeah, it has sunk in big time. I just, I feel all greasy and 
and lovely and nice. So I have actually had three croissants this morning. Um, I've had a few sour patch and I'm gonna have some uh, pre-workout in a minute. I'm gonna take some pump product uh, and some pre. Just start a session like I normally kind of would, warm up, essentially pump up, right, before I send off this, this kind of application. And then that will be that. The chart has been ticked off. 159 is on the cards. We are done, people. We're done. And I want to thank you all for your support over the past kind of few months, because I know it's been a long, long, long time, right? It's been since pretty much February when we started this particular process. And I, although it hasn't ended exactly as, as I was kind of expecting it to, sometimes that's for the best, you know? I think we'll look back at this and think, yeah, that, that was... That was pretty damn cool and, and I wanted to thank you all for your messages, for your comments and everything. If you subscribe, if you are new to the channel over this kind of last six months or so, welcome. Stick around. I hope I've managed to keep you kind of entertained, you know, because um, this video is a summer shredding entry at the end of the day. And who does summer shredding? Who runs summer shredding? It's, it's Christian, you know, Christian is the face if you like. Um, and I have personally really, really missed his videos this month. They've been a staple for my kind of routine. They've been a staple for my um, life for the past kind of five years. You know, whether I've taken part or not, I think I've taken part in the online competition for three, four years now, three years, I think. I'm not sure, and it doesn't matter. Um, but the videos, you know, I, re I really, really have missed the videos. It's been a good five or six years staple in, in my life personally. Um, and so I've missed that motivation. I've missed that kind of, that, that escapism that I got from watching those videos. So um, I wanted to thank you guys for tuning in and I hope um, I have provided that for you, you know, because at the end it's not just me that doesn't get to watch the videos, it's, it's you guys as well. And I know that a lot of you guys do rely on, on, on that kind of motivational, kind of consistent content, you know, and it's been difficult with everything that's going on in, in, in 2020 and stuff. So I hope that I have been able to provide that in some way, shape or form for some of you. Um, some of you are probably watching and thinking, <laughs> shut up mate, but I know this sounds daft, but I wanted, to, I wanted to say thank you, you know, because creating these videos is, is my form of escapism. It's my way of kind of getting out. It's my way of kind of just, I, I don't know, expressing, you know, it's my way of expressing myself. Um, and I can just escape and just forget about anything and everything and just, edit you know just do what i love and that is edit videos you know we've had competitions and stuff keep you guys motivated keep you guys focused keep you guys smiling happy um i try to tell a joke every now and then as well but i just want to say a quick thank you um for the past few months in particular and uh yeah on to the next one fresh fade over the top tan i'm gonna get a pump and um yeah let's crack on with the entry if you happen to give a damn, we are going to go with the Strawberry Kiwi pre-workout, which is a new tub that I still haven't actually tried yet, and the pump in the rainbow sherbet flavour. I'm going to put a scoop of each into a big old jug like that, and that'll be that, people. LSJ at checkout, mate. <laughs> Responsible for all the gains. I'm not sure how these two flavours are going to mix, though, but hey, we'll give it a go. <laughs> Yeah, they don't go together. Recommend them separately. Like ketchup and ice cream. Love them both, but don't have them together. I'm good today. Oh, I'm feeling good today. veins coming in all the way down across here not come out fully to play this year but maybe next year right eh? yeah you know what guys yeah yeah I'm, I'm I'm happy with this so today's date is Friday the 9th of October 2020 all right how are we doing everybody my name is Liam Harold and this is my summer training 2020 final entry so relax from the front relax from the side from the back and the other side. A few poses.
current weight is 160 pounds dead. I was a little bit lighter than that first thing this morning, but got a couple of meals and a bit of water in me. So thank you so much for this opportunity and I'll see you next time. And honorable mention to the calves as well, because the calves, even though I've not been able to train legs properly or anything like that, the calves have been loyal. And considering, again, I haven't trained legs for about six weeks, really happy with this leg, and I actually kind of just forced myself to contract this leg today. Nice little separation, because we're actually lean. <sighs> but the leg has really suffered from today, you know? But that's my summer shredding. Entry done. Ladies and gentlemen, that is that. We are officially bulking. Woo! The trusty scales have done us proud. 159, let it go! I accidentally, on purpose, finished this entire bag of Sour Patch just to celebrate. Is there one left in the bottom? I think there might be one left. There's not one left, it was just the sugar. I honestly feel really, really, really good about that, guys. Like, it could have been so much worse. Obviously, with the whole knee situation, like, I was like, how am I gonna flex my legs? I was like, how am I gonna do this? How am I gonna do that? The past six, seven weeks, I've not been able to, I've physically not been able to do any cardio. Staying in a deficit, I couldn't even plant my feet for a friggin' bench press properly. Like, could I have done better than this this year? 100%, right? If my knee didn't cock up. But the reality is, my knee did go wrong. Something went wrong. That was the barrier, the biggest barrier that I've had in the past six years, right? And we still stuck to the chart. We still stuck to our goal. And we absolutely smashed it. And to be honest, I'm going to give myself a pat on the back. I am proud of myself. I think, you know, I, I think I've done good. I mean, are we going to win? <laughs> I don't know. But... We stuck to this. We smashed it out of the park. 159. Up yours, mate. I'm gonna have some sour patch and uh, celebrate. I think me and Charlotte might have something nice for dinner as well tonight, you know? Maybe a Lodo. Actually, not joking. I think I might have a Lodo tonight. This pizza at the end of the day. This is what I'm trying to explain to all of you guys. I'm gonna have a shower and wash this tan off because my face to shoulder, deltoid and pectoral skin colour is um, not even close to being the same. But <laughs> also absolutely stinks. It reeks. If this was a scratch and sniff freaking camera through YouTube, you would be going woohoo, get in the shower limb. See look now my friggin' veins come out and stuff. Look at that. Oh my god. I've got right buzz on right now. I feel really ga I'm gassed. I'm absolutely gassed. I feel re I feel great. I feel really, really good. At the end of the day, we have stuck to this and still enjoyed life. We have stuck to this. Despite everything that's going on, we have stuck to this despite all the challenges like like the knee, oh boo-hoo, yeah I know, it hurts, okay? Give me the knee, give me it, right? We've stuck to it, regardless of everything that's been going on. We've not sacrificed any date nights, I've not sacrificed any of my social events, any of my anything, I've not sacrificed anything. Slow and steady really does win the race and we're going to apply that same philosophy to the lean balking plan. If you want to get these kinds of results, no. Am I competition shredded? No. Of course I'm fucking not. <laughs> That's a different level. But do I look alright? Yeah. In my opinion. Do I look alright in your opinion? What's that? No? No, no? Oh! oh, 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 oh. Doesn't matter! Entry number 6,650. Going in three, two, one. Oh, where did it go? There we go. We done. We are done. There's the two videos. You can tell just by the friggin' thumbnails, the difference. Oh my god, look at those two pictures. What the hell? Hey babe. Yeah? What's it like having a shredded boyfriend? You, you should know. Because he is sat right here and he is shredded AF. Have you not just seen the entirety of my Summer Shredding 2020 video? I actually just entered. I was entry number 6,000 or something. I wonder how many people actually are going to enter out of the Million. six. Like, about like 10,000 people bought tickets for. Anyway, that is going to be that, people. That is officially the end. I hope you have enjoyed it. I've enjoyed this, this past kind of six months or so. 
slow and steady always wins the race unless it's summer shredding in which case you stand a one in about 20,000 chance of winning but anyway I did my best I hope you have enjoyed it and I look forward to putting on a some size in the near future. In all seriousness, I think it will actually genuinely help my knee, right? Because I've been in quite a heavy deficit for the past few weeks to kind of stay in a deficit because I can't do cardio. Um, I won't have to worry about that so much now so that my, my body can, you know, I can pretty much give my body a, a few more calories to help heal my knee properly, which is probably the thing I'm most excited about. But that is that. I want to thank you all so much for your support. Stay tuned for the Lean Balking Plan coming very, 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 very soon. What should they do when the Lean Balking Plan comes out, babe? Buy it. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. It says you can eat Domino's twice a week. Uh, it doesn't say that specifically, but... And McDonald's breakfast! <laughs> no, wait, this is the lean bulk plan, babe. Lean bulk, we're keeping it lean. Ignore her, right, okay? Like this video if you have enjoyed it. Comment down below and subscribe if you are new. Welcome to the team. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Together, we will grow. And I will see you when I've had a shower and got this tan off. In the next one.